It is a challenging security environment there because it's multi-story. Uh, as you mentioned, with the subway coming in there, buses coming in, everybody discharging passengers. There's roads that skirt the garden, so there's a lot of vulnerable areas. Bob Kinder is a retired Army Ranger and counterterrorism expert. In addition to increased screenings and random metal detections at tonight's Celtics Cavs game, Kinder says multiple agencies are working to secure areas well beyond those access points. They're trying to create a layered defense, pushing that perimeter out through the use of closed circuit television. Uh, intelligence surveillance and reconnaissance assets, canines that are able to detect uh, vapor of a potential uh, explosive device moving by. But now more than ever, Kinder says good old fashioned police work and our own personal observations are crucial. Don't be frightened, but be wary. You know, keep your head on a swivel. It is extremely important to know there is no known threat to the garden, to the game tonight. We're live outside the garden. Julie Lonchek, WCVB News Center 5.